Okay, we continue our morning conversation. Life as a mistress is not as rosy as it seems. I'm in the same situation. I think we've been thinking for the last nine years, and I'm asking my, myself the same question. How we, how you'll move on from there? Oh, yes, because now this guy is he's not a young man. I'm 40. He's about 65. Do you see a future with him? No, I can't really tell. Okay, he's all over me. Yeah. We do everything together, but this is the kind of life that we're living. This was not what I was looking for. How will you look for what you want? Okay, what do you want? No, no, it, it feels like I, I've already lost it. <laughs> you feel like you've missed the bus. Oh, yeah. Wow. You give half your life to someone, and they just walk off into the sunset with another person. Do you ever think about the future? That's a question I'm asking. Maggie, I got your SMS. She's saying, ask yourself this question, Maina. How many widows are there? So what's wrong with being 51 and alone? I'm never worried of the future alone, but worried of the future being poor. Wow. Haki Adani. Goja, goja. Maggie. But you so <laughs> Good morning, Maina. I've got three kids from a previous marriage and I'm a mistress to a guy. Although he assists, I'm financially stable and have no intention whatsoever to get married to him or any man for that reason. When the retirement time comes, things will sort themselves out. Why worry about tomorrow? It's not in your power. You woke up today. The future doesn't bother you. The, the fact that this married man is just using you, fine, he's bought you a car in a house and a kabiyashara, but other than that, he just comes to relieve himself, make some small talk, maybe a relationship has developed but the full fact is you're never gonna be number one you're never gonna be his top priority that has got to worry you no it's true you have to make them feel very bad no 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 miss wali you have to you know you know <laughs> <laughs> no, do you do you understand the life you're living? That's my question. Your future is like you're working for revenue retirement benefit authority. Do, do, can you hear yourself? Now are you a minor utakuya kuwa? And let me tell you, eh? that will be the end of this. Utachi kazi. By the way, this ikazi, they should know. Okay. Hello, Classic 105. Good morning. Yes. I have been a mistress to a fifty one year old for the past five years. Yeah. I don't know how to get out because mm. Okay, attacky, attacky, udet, any, any, attacky, udet, that I'm too young. And how old are you? I am 26. Okay. So, okay, when I'm too young, mm. and, and ask everybody, and I'm you dating these young people, I give you everything, and you could have a job, and then I could rent a new number, and you have a car, why should you do this young people? Like, he, me, how is it, I don't know, like a quarrel, attacky, could you quit to, you know, no, no, situation, and you complicated. So, so, who is it, okay? Okay, you're able to date him too young, I can find out. So let me ask you a question. Mm -hmm. Will you have his baby? Do you have his baby? No. Um, I'm not in my family planning. Do you intend to one day have a baby for him? No. What if he asks you for one? I don't know. He has never asked, imagine. So how long are you going to be with him? He's not going to marry you, you know that? Yes. So why are you... I don't know, I'm confused, I'm confused. Do you love him? Yes, yes, I, I am so in love. I know his friends, I know his, his workmates, but not his brothers. But he has never taken me for introduction or anything. I asked him to come see my parents. Uh, excuses, excuses. But he gives me everything. We spend the weekend together. Kila kitu. Almost every day. Okay. All right. Thank you. Mm. All right.